Hey everyone, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can log out of your Google account on the iPhone. And there are actually multiple ways how you can do it. And it also depends which app you are using to like be logged in with. Because for example, if you go to your Safari, you may be logged in with your Google account right inside of the google.com. So right here at the top of the page, you have your profile picture. You can tap on it and you can easily just log out. It's not in English, but here is the log out button. And if you do that, it's just going to log you out of that Safari. So right now you can see I am in a basic Google account with the login button available. But that's just one thing. Also, besides that, you may have some Google application and download it. So let's say it's going to be the Google Sheets or Gmail or whatever it is. So for example, it's going to be the Gmail. Right now, again, although I have logged out of my Safari and I have like uh, disabled my Google account from like this web page, I still have it inside of the Gmail app. So you will most likely have to go through all of your Google apps to like log out. For example, in here, you need to tap on your profile picture again. And here you need to manage accounts on this device. So go ahead and tap on that. And and here you can see all of these accounts. So you can see this main one is activated. The other ones are not activated, but I can actually remove them from my device just by tapping on them like this. And removing account, uh, this account and any unsaved data will be removed from Gmail and other Google apps on this device. So this not only applies to the Gmail, but also to, for example, some Google Sheets or whatever. So if you remove it, it's just going to remove it from this Gmail app, but as well as from the other ones, for example, as I said, the Sheets or many different Google applications that are available. But you should also know that you may not actually use anything from Google and still have the Google account there. So it doesn't really matter. For example, in the Notion app, when I just go inside Notion and I'm actually seeing my notes, those notes are logged in with my Google account, with my Gmail again. So this is kind of annoying, actually, because I use Google for many different things, but it's great that it's so integrated. But the annoying thing is that if you want to log out, you have to go through all of the apps, but the service is really good. So yeah, I just kind of thought that you should know about it. And also the next thing and the last thing is by going through the settings. And if you go, for example, to your email contacts or calendar you may see all of your accounts in here so again you can see my gmail account but this one has never even showed up inside my gmail or uh, the other google apps not at all but this is right inside of the ios settings so this is another place where you may have your google account ready but if you want to like remove it you can just delete the account or deactivate the mail contacts calendar or notes so that's how it works. So these are all of the places where you can delete or like log out of your uh, Google account on the iPhone. I hope the video helped you out and I hope that you found it valuable. For more information like this, make sure to subscribe to the Fox Tech YouTube channel and we can see each other in the future. Thanks. Peace out.